I never thought we would meet like this, Guan Yu. I last saw you ride off on red hair. And now the same steed has brought you here to impede my path. Go, Lord Cao Cao. Consider my debt to you paid in full. Is this where my struggle finally ends? Guan Yu, was my fate decided from the very moment that you left me? Go. It is still not possible for me to forget my debt to you. But that debt ends here. The next time you oppose my lord, I will kill you. Remember that, Lord Cao Cao. Lord Guan Yu, do you intend to ignore the debt you owe our lord? Or will that horse, that wild red hair, change you into a demon as well? Go. I give you my thanks, Zhang Liao. I almost made the wrong choice. A choice that I would have surely regretted. Huh. So my greatest enemy turns out to be you. Go. Is this duty or pity? If anything, it is confidence. I truly believe that Liu Bei will soon soar high above this land. When that day comes, you and I will meet again on even footing. And I will claim the very head from your shoulders. Until we meet again, then. Master Guan Yu, you would harm my lord, not while I'm here. That might have been my intention at another time. Today, however, my honor will not allow it. <laughs> lord Cao Cao, Zhang Liao, until we meet again in battle. I have been defeated. Utterly defeated. Yet, you still live. You are right. This chaos shall continue for a while yet. Just as Master Zhuge Liang anticipated, they have come this way, but they shall go no further! I'm Zhou Tsang, disciple of the god of war, Guan Yu. I warn you, I'm three times as strong as usual when I'm alongside the boss. Why, Master Guan Yu, I haven't seen you since you fought for Lord Cao Cao. If you still remember that debt, 
Will you please back down from this battle? You may go, but know that this is the last kindness I will show you. You sure, boss? Well, if you say so. Master Guan Yu, thank you. Now, hurry onward! 